Um, is French Polynesia as beautiful as it looks? Um, yeah. <laughs> I am Mark, here with my wife, Mandy. We're going to be doing five nights in the beautiful Hilton Moran, and we'd like to bring you guys along for the ride. We're going to be doing uh, three excursions. Um, we're going to be doing sea scooters, which should be awesome, uh, doing the uh, ATV ride up in the mountains here in Moran. Then on Friday we have a private catamaran tour. Uh, really excited about that. We just got in, um, getting our spa day today in. And wait a second. I think I need to catch you guys up. Yeah, let's catch you up here. started from PDX to LAX, which is approximately a two-hour flight. Good thing I wasn't riding my bike. Unfortunately, we sat next to a lady who continued to pick her nose. We're talking knuckles deep here, people. LAX to Papayete is approximately, oh, eight and a half hours or so, give or take. And once we got there, we were tired, but we were able to catch a cab over to the ferry station. Now, the ferry will take you over from Tahiti to this side of Morea. It was a pretty relaxing ride. We had a really nice time. It was good to just at that point look around and see some scenery and just start to take in where we were at. We had already booked our taxi with the concierge who was there waiting for us at the um, arrival point. It was very nice of the taxi driver to allow us to stop up at this very famous spot to take pictures above the Sofitel Hotel. We will be taking a trip uh, over here later on in the excursions. Got to the Hilton, and it's it's laid out pretty nice. We've got a shop here to the left for just normal stuff, and then they have a pearl shop to the right. This whole section is laid out pretty good. Um, the main restaurant is up and to the left here where they do breakfast and some dinners. And then you've got the, um, bar to the right. Um, it's, it's all great seating and has really, really great views. Okay. It's like what? 10 hours, 12 hours, something, That's 14 nice. hours, 22 hours. I don't know. No here we sleep, are. No sleep, no nothing. Here so. we are. Check this stuff out. Like, so we got about five or six hours to wait until our room's ready. Um, we're just going to chill here. Relax, enjoy the breeze, and uh, give you guys a peek of this real quick. So we decided to go ahead and hop in the ocean for a little bit, just to get cooled off. We walked around the grounds for a little while and was just checking stuff out, it was pretty nice. Hopped in the pool shower and then lazed around the pool for a bit. All right, looks like we got our room. It's ready. This is where we're going to be staying. Number 53 right there. This little one. This is three are over the water. There's uh, all these ones are overwater bungalows. These are actually, you can get a really good deal on these um, garden ones. Uh, we, that's what we usually do is the garden, the garden villas and stuff. Um, and we usually spend our money on private excursions and whatnot. Got some coconuts rolling in the water over there. Give you a little bit of a, a room tour. Eddie's hat's been blowing away, so she's trying to keep a hold on that. Oh, this is going to be good. Here we go.
Looks like we got our coffee. Stuff right there. We got a closet, safety box. Got the uh, glass in the floor. Nice size bed. Oh, this is the. Um, yeah, check this out. Bathroom. Yeah, the bathroom. Got a nice tub. Double sinks. This does go straight through. So you can see right into the. <laughs> I think this has like a pull down though. You can pull it down or something, but we won't need that. Yep, walk in shower area. I think this is just the toilet. Yep. But the coolest thing uh, that I really love about, about this is right out here. This is the best. Having your cup of coffee in the morning, come out. Hey, baby, will you grab that for me? Grab that pack. Thanks. Right out here. A little windy today, so that's supposed to die down. Just come out here. Have your coffee or whatever. We have a uh, little step down. water and at least that way it's like you don't have to try to knock the sand off of your feet or anything like that so we're gonna be doing we're gonna be doing a lot of snorkeling out here probably tomorrow we're gonna go by the um, bar and grill and get some hamburgers or something later but uh, yeah we're, we're officially in it's time to get cleaned up for real and not just do a ocean wash which is what we, what we did and, um, yeah, maybe get some sleep and feel like a human for a bit. But anyway, that's the room tour. And I'm showing you guys some more stuff in the future. The next morning was really gorgeous. Got a full night's sleep. Woke up feeling just refreshed, ready to go. And always got to sit out on the deck, uh, have some coffee, and uh, watch the fish that were just right outside of the bungalow. It was great. So we headed on over to the breakfast, which is a buffet breakfast that you get for free if you have Hilton status. Uh, I totally recommend if you're going to do a trip like this, get a card, get something, get those free breakfasts. It'll save you a lot of money. There was a cat that would come by, politely beg once in a while. I thought that was actually pretty cool that Hilton works with the animals around the area. And I think this is very cool because not only do they help clean up and keep pests away, but it really feels like you're interacting with nature the whole time you're there. Okay, we just got done eating super big breakfast. Um, case in point, uh, you gotta figure out what you want your experience to be. If you're taking a long flight, and for me and Mandy this time it was, it was it felt like a lot longer flight. My muscles got all stiff, and this was a pretty hard one. But you know, when you're at a resort like this, the cool thing is, is you take that extra day. Don't plan any excursions on your first on your first uh, day. Just soak it in. <sighs> Take that extra day, and uh, we're gonna go to the spa. Uh, we're gonna relax. Uh, what I like about being at a resort like this is that I think the breakfast is free. We just had an insanely huge breakfast. Kind of anything you wanted. Everything was really really good. Um, yeah, and it's what well, Manny just said. It's like during lunchtime, basically our time. So it's kind of like get that free meal and it was really really good so we're gonna just take this today and chill get a get a massage definitely do some snorkeling around uh, around here because you know yeah so so this is a big one take the time get a massage on your first day oftentimes you won't even realize how tense that you actually are and trust me it'll be worth it all right, getting ready to go out and do some snorkeling. Make sure always to put your reef safe sunblock on. Use some, uh, you know, uh, swim, shirts. swim shirts so you're safe from the sun on your swim shirts. Don't get, don't get burned. That's bad. So uh, catch you guys in a little bit.
And we ended a really awesome first day at the Ratui Bar and Grill where I got the sashimi, as always. Make sure that you join us tomorrow. Uh, we go on one of the best excursions I think I've ever been on, at least top five here, with Morea Water Games. And man, it was amazing. Top five best excursions I've ever been on. Check it out.